the latest celebrity to find themselves in flat earth hot water uh, also happens to be uh, one that's gotten himself into other trouble as well and I noticed this article about 10 days ago, and I'm kind of surprised that nobody in the Flat Earth world has made this yet. So I'm, all I'm going to do is I'm going to read from a Billboard magazine article uh, that was run on July 13th, 2016 by Karen Bliss. And the title is called The Tenor Singer Who Said All Lives Matter Also Thinks the World is Flat. And I'll read it in its entirety. It's not that long. Uh, the tenors Remigio Pereira likely didn't envision the fallout when he altered the lyrics to the Canadian National Anthem to include the words All Lives Matter at the Major League Baseball All-Star Game Tuesday, July 12th, night in San Diego. Holding up a United We Stand and a All Lives Matter sign during O Canada, the tenors subsequently dismissed him from the group until further notice. Aside from his controversial reference to All Lives Matter, which many see as an offensive whitewashing backlash to the Black Lives Matter movement, the singer's social media is rife with conspiracy theories, including his belief that the world is flat. On Instagram, he posted a photo of the Earth as flat with the message, planet or ball. Use your own intelligence senses and don't just blindly accept things. Ask questions. Our view of the world will dictate our children's future. Watching a television program influences viewers to believe and reflect what the program wants you to believe in order to benefit the programmer. Do your own research, do your own experiments, and you will be surprised and enlightened by the world in which we live. You may find the truth under a protective layer. With your own research, you will find the truth inside of you and not outside of you. Among the hashtags used are hashtag Flat Earth and hashtag Eric Dubay, the man behind the Flat Earth conspiracy. In a July 11th Facebook post, Pereira, shared Simon Grinnell's video of the sun basking in a cloud with the status, the sun in front of clouds? It is impossible for the sun to be 93 million miles away and yet be stuck in between clouds. Things that make you go, hmm, hashtag NASA, hashtag creation. And on July 9th, the singer made a lengthy post with the video Flat Earth, Why the Lie, that begins the world will soon realize the lies and the deception put before us all when we one day awaken to a new state of being, a state of being held hostage by the same elite corporations and military industrial complex that told us that they had our best interests at heart. Greed and fear is their opium of choice and they administer it to us to destroy our ability to think for ourselves. Our mind, minds, are being manipulated and destroyed via GMO poisonous foods, chemical spraying of our skies, a state of fear induced by their media, and lastly, by force, as we see happening now. People, friends, sentient beings become the image you were made from, become being the great being taught us to be. Despite his apology on Instagram, there are others on Facebook and his Twitter account about altering O Canada and holding up the sign. His explanation shows he still doesn't understand the Black Lives Matter movement and why his actions were seen as disrespectful. I've been so moved lately by the tragic loss of life and I had hoped for a positive comment that would bring us all together. One love, he wrote. That was my singular motivation when I said all lives matter. Love, peace, and harmony for all has always been my life's purpose. His ex-girlfriend, Shemaine McAuliffe, said as much in her Facebook post about the incident. In part, it reads, Remy, who was born in America, and yes, from Boston, is fed up with the lack of unity in his birth country and now today. He proved Canadians aren't any different. Remy is a vegan, and all he ever advocates for is peace and respect for all life, including animals. He's asking why such a prejudice towards animals. People are wrong to color code the statement, all lives matter. His message should have 
taken at been taken at face value. That was his message. Media assumed differently. So let's crucify him now for it. He is one of the kindest people away from the spotlight I've ever met. He cares more about the peace in this world than the money he's put in his manager's pocket. How quickly he was ostracized by those to claim they love him. They should be ashamed. How quickly the world condemns a man trying to make positive change. Malice isn't evident if that wasn't his intent. To those who claim that wasn't the right place to do it well i think this was the perfect time to show the world just how divided we truly are as a human race we do not stand in perfect harmony if you think remy is wrong then you do not know him personally as i do the rest of the tenors clifton murray fraser walters victor mcauliffe posted this statement and a publicist told billboard they will not be doing any further interviews. An email to the group's manager, Jeffrey Latimer, was not returned. The tenors are deeply sorry for the disrespectful and misguided lack of judgment by one member of the group acting as a lone wolf today during the singing of the Canadian National Anthem at the Major League Baseball All-Star Game in, in San Diego. The other members of the group are shocked and embarrassed by the actions of Remigio, who changed the lyrics of our treasured anthem and used this coveted platform to serve his own political views. Our sincere apologies and regrets go out to everybody who witnessed this shameful act, to our fellow Canadians, to Major League Baseball, to our friends, families, fans, and to all those affected. The actions of one member of this group were extremely selfish, and he will not be performing with the tenors until further notice. That's the end of the article, but I'm sure it's not the end of Remigio and his flat earth journey. That's about it, guys. So uh, please look it up online. You know, just look up his name, uh, look up tenors. There's about 400 articles, as, as far as I can tell, uh, out there. And But no television uh, footage. I, I never found a single video clip of anybody talking about this, uh, even Canadian footage. So uh, you got to wonder why. So is he the third celebrity? Will there be others outside of him? You don't know, but he's raising a few eyebrows. Anyway, stay flat, guys.